Welcome to the wonderful world of the 901. I'm Caleb Hilliard, and tomorrow, Memphis Miss Basketball is taking on the undefeated Ole Miss Rebels. On paper, Memphis has a more talented team, but this Ole Miss squad should not be underestimated. Chris Beard is considered to be one of the best coaches in college basketball, and the Rebels have one of the best backcourt tandems in the SEC. Memphis native Matt Morrell made it on the preseason All-SEC second team, and six foot six guard Al Flanagan leads the team with 16 points per game. On the flip side, I could go on and on about this talented Memphis team, but I'll let Coach Beard do the honors. It's early season. A lot could be said about our team too, but I would argue that um, when they're playing the way that I'm sure they want to play, when they're playing well, I think they're as good as anybody in college basketball. And through the first six games of the season, we have seen this Tigers team full of transfers start to take shape. But center Jordan Brown hasn't emerged as a dominant center that Penny believes he can be. And with former Memphis Tiger Musa Cisse, a giant seven foot center, becoming eligible for the Rebs this week, the Tigers need Jordan Brown to be a dominant force. You know, he has to reach an elite level for us to, to make it to that next level. He's got to be a 16 and 10, a 15 and 8. He's got to be that guy, you know for us down there because he can score on the post. We need him to score. And don't forget, coming up in about 10 minutes, the Grizzlies are taking on the Mavs in Dallas. Now, Luka Doncic is out because his baby was born today. So congrats to, Don to the Doncic family for their little baby, Gabriella. And that is your 901.